Hey, so what's up guys? Make it with Joy Tech back again with another video for you guys. And today I'm back in my studio because I have a very special unboxing for you guys and I didn't really expect to be getting this today. But here it is. This is the Hero 9 Black. So I just got this uh, probably an hour or two ago. I just grabbed it from the GoPro store. So honestly, I'm really excited to be unboxing the Hero 9 Black because of the front screen because I really need the front screen especially when I'm filming myself, when I'm outdoors. And uh, I was thinking whether should I get this or the Sony ZV-1 But uh, considering that I do ride scooters and I do some outdoor activities I do bring my cameras around for like trip videos and stuff So I thought that a camera that is you know protected against the elements would be much better than a camera that is not Especially if you're filming in seasons like winter or in a rainstorm You don't have to worry about a camera like the Hero 9 Black Honestly I've been using the Hero 8 for a couple of uh, months now I think close to a year I think that the Hero 8 Black is a pretty good camera overall but uh, there are some shortcomings especially when it comes to night video and also the battery life which is a main concern for me. I've bought three batteries, I bought the external charger and so on and so forth but I still feel carrying a lot of batteries, a lot of accessories around really is kind of a burden. I have to wash all my accessories to make sure that they don't get lost and stuff like that. I have to carry a bag for them but hopefully with the Hero 9, uh, all those worries are going to be eliminated. That's why I got this. But before we begin the unboxing of the Hero 9 Black, do consider subscribing to this channel and also ding the notification bell so you can get notified on the latest content which I post and do share it with your friends, uh, your relatives, whoever that may be interested in products like this. So without further ado, let's get right into the unboxing of the Hero 9 Black. Alright guys, so we are back and something I forgot to mention is the price. So this retails at 2,099 ringgit and if you are the first 400 customers, you can actually click on the link which they will provide you at the shop and you can click in and fill in your details and get a free battery for the Hero 9 Black. As of now, there are no accessories for the Hero 9 Black because it's still very new. There's no batteries, there are no cases, there's no screen protectors, basically nothing for the Hero 9 Black except whatever comes in the box and of course your previous mouse if you had a GoPro before so basically that's what is compatible now the, the old batteries are not compatible because this is actually using a new battery a bigger battery and overall your cages and your cases from your previous Hero 8, Hero 7, Hero 6 and previous models will not work because this is actually a bigger form factor overall and I've actually tried it at the store before I bought it because I was thinking Hmm, if it's very similar to the Hero 8, why would I get the Hero 9? But after trying it out and testing out Hyper Smooth, I think this is a really, really good upgrade to the Hero 8. Alright guys, so let's take a look at the packaging of the Hero 9 Black. It's a pretty different package as uh, previous GoPro models because they've actually cut the plastic from the packaging. So you can see it's all basically paper. So on the front, you can see GoPro branding, Hyper Smooth 3.0 Hero 9 Black. You can see the front screen which is the major highlight of the Hero 9 Black so you can see here the features it's also listed on the side so you can see they have changed out the sensor so now it's a 20 megapixel sensor you can take 5k at 30 or 4k at 60 which is like you know 4k and 60 is a pretty normal standard uh, it's also waterproof as usual voice control there's also 8x slow-mo and there's a lot of features like hindsight so you can record it even before hitting the record button. So there's also webcam mode, which is also a feature currently available on the Hero 8 after the update. So there are some stuff where there's uh, upgrades like Time Warp 3.0, which has horizons leveling or something like that. So it's pretty good. You can see 1080p live streaming. So it's pretty good. This is what comes in the packaging. You can see the camera here. There's also, of course, the battery. Then there is the thumb screw, the mounting, the cable and also a new thing included which is the carrying case this is good because i have now have two gopro cameras and i can carry both in this packaging but we'll see about that later on you can see how good the bag is all right so let's uh, pull the tab right now so you can see it's actually sealed all right so let's see what comes in the packaging so this is so much easier to open than the previous uh, GoPro boxes. So this is basically my third GoPro already. Alright, so let's see what comes in this nice carrying case. So I'm really, really happy that they actually decided to get rid of the plastic housing and go with this carrying case because I think for traveling, yes, this is a much better option. It's a very nice and solid hard case. Let's unzip it and see what comes inside. So you can see there's also GoPro branding on the top. Alright, so opening the package, we can see 
there are a couple of stuff here some paperwork on top so the camera is right here this is a nice uh, sort of a plasticky feeling shell I think I'll be keeping this in here so I can store my GoPro back into the case so I don't think you should throw this away many YouTubers have actually thrown this away but I think you should not okay right here we have the charging cable USB-C charging cable which is uh, what most phones use these days okay now here is the bigger battery you can see right here is the bigger battery it's a good thing they have actually increased the size for the battery let me grab my old Hero 8 battery and give you a comparison right here Alright, so this is a comparison of the GoPro Hero 9 and the Hero 8 battery. You can see the size much bigger on the Hero 9 because it's a bigger camera with more screens as well. Bigger screens in fact. So you can see the size, so that's a good comparison. Alright, so the battery aside, let's see what comes in the case. Let's see, this is a mount, part of this mount. So there's a sticky mount right here. So I have this mounted on my scooter in fact. What else do we have here? We have a thumb screw. Take a look, it's a normal thumb screw. There are many better third party ones out there as well. So you can purchase them or you can buy back the original GoPro ones if you do fancy them. Okay, so this is the Hero 9 right here. You can see the fancy new screen in front. Very nice. And also, this lens uh, cap is actually interchangeable, so you can swap it out for ND filters and whatnot. But of course, I will not be doing that because I don't really use ND filters in general. So you can see all the stickers right here. Won't be peeling them off. But I'll be sliding this leaf off to show you the camera. Let me see whether I can do that quickly. So, body wise, material wise, it's very similar to the Hero 8. So, very nice overall. You can see the power button on the top. This is the door for the USB C as well as the battery. You can see it's empty right now. Your micro SD slot is here as well. So, make sure you to keep this clean and also make sure this is actually sealed. Alright, so let's take a look at the left side of the camera I should say so you can see there's a mode down as a power on button you can see the Hero 9 black and on the back you can see this is a much bigger screen I'll be getting a screen protector for this camera so I'll not be removing the plastics off yet because this is just an unboxing okay let's take a look at the bottom similar feet to the Hero 8 so these are very very sturdy you might think this might break over time but for me no I've ridden scooters over curbs off-road trails and honestly nothing has ever happened to the feet the feet are still strong i mean they are still there so this is a very nice packaging let's see what else comes in this case so you can see subscribe to gopro there's a qr code right here so unlimited storage they ask you to subscribe that's what all the companies are doing um you can see this is the app you can do and also how to install the battery for the first time if you're a new gopro user yeah but basically it's pretty straightforward uh and yes on the back you can see how you can stick the sticky mount to your helmet pretty nice and also some gopro stickers so i do love them gopro stickers and also there's a have product questions some regulatory information so this has been a very quick unboxing of the hero 9 black i'll be doing more coverage on this camera right here and also on the battery life in a future video so do stay tuned if you do want me to show you comparison of the hero 9 black against the hero 8 also do state in the comments and i'll try to make that happen as soon as i can so i'll be showing you some test footage later on maybe in the next video when i do a review of the camera so that's all for this video guys i hope this camera doesn't disappoint me but i've been a very big fan of the hero 8 black and i do love the basically the form factor of the camera because it's very small and compact and also gives a pretty good footage so that's all for this video guys i hope you guys like it and if you did like it hit the thumbs up button and so do consider subscribing to this channel and i'll see you guys in the next video